Okay, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. Got the new motor. Finally showed up today. Why they took so long, I have no clue. Um, so we got the motor out. It's actually a super easy job. You'll take this bolt out right here. It's a 10 mil. Not a big deal. Now, the problem part is when you do the motor, because it's in there like this, the screws come in from the backside. They're also a 10 mil. One 10 mil ratchet. Easiest way to get in there. Um, so we're gonna do a, a quickie clean out and I'll get some of the loose trash that's in here out. There we go. Takes care of that. So we'll get everything taken care of, get the new motor lined up into place and we should be good as gold. So I'll, I'll get it into place, line it up, bolt it, and then I will run power to it before I run the wiring to it so that we make sure everything goes up and down like it's supposed to. There's no window issues because I've never seen this window go up and or down, but apparently, and I don't quite know, I didn't put any of these parts in. Warning, install motor, then remove bolt. Okay, what bolt? So, we'll see, I don't know. I mean, we know the window goes up and down and it actually goes up and down quite nicely. There's no, no issues. Let me pull this back up again. And there we go. But it's back up. It goes up and down like it's supposed to by hand but we just want to do it by power. So give me a couple minutes, I'll put this one in and hopefully I can show you guys a test of the motor going up and down. So sweet. All right, see you in a few. And here we go, ladies and gentlemen. She's in, she's wired, she's fabulous and working absolutely like she's supposed to. So one down. One to go. Okay, guys, this one's going to be a super short one because I need to get that done and then I can get that mirror fixed on that side. So we're getting there slowly but surely. Thank you, thank you, thank you, guys. Have a good one and see you on the flip side.